Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 cutty, black with the purple strip. Fam, so, um, yeah. 23 20 Ravens win. I have no idea. I'm gonna be real. I have no idea what I'm gonna say about this game. I pulled up the stats, I haven't looked at them yet. As um, if you're new, I like to just to pull up the stats and just give you my raw thoughts of what I see and how I feel about the game. I already did the highlight video. Hopefully, you all enjoy that. Um, if you have not seen it, it'll be at the end of this video. But for those you, for those of you that are already seen it, thank you for checking it out and thank you for um, giving me the thumbs up or just telling me what you think in the comments. Now. Uh, right off the bat, before I get to the stats, <sighs> defense was, um, they was, um, oh, there's the other video completed. Highlight video as I'm doing this. <laughs> um, yeah, this one, um, defense did, they okay. That first drive, I was like, oh, Lord, here we go. Defense did okay. Offense was uh, it was boring. I think I seen somebody on Twitter say like Lamar did like sixteen or Lamar said he did like sixteen pass attempts or something like that. I'm not sure yet because I haven't looked at the stats. But yeah, um, if that doesn't scream, we need wide receiver help. And I ain't talking about no one year Deshaun Jackson or no practice squad Andy Isabella. I know DJ Moore is not going to happen, but hello, Jerry Judy, uh, freaking, um, what's that, Goodwin? S come on. Like, dude. The offense started so slow, but let me get into the stats. Here we go. Oh, God, the offense. Okay, starting off. Yeah, okay, there it is right there. I didn't even... I ain't look. I don't know when I was saying it was right there. Okay, sixteen attempts, nine complete. QBR forty six, one hundred twenty yards. Got sacked three times. <sighs> yeah, that says when I get to this wide receiver stat, it's not gonna be good. Okay, so let me scroll a little bit. And let me start right about there, so you all can see it as well. Gus the bus cooking. He was cooking. He got more than uh, six carries I thought he was going to get, but 16 carries, 66 yards, two TDs, 12 is the longest. Jackson, 10 carries, 59 yards, 11 was the youngest. Justice Hill, five carries, 26. Justice was cooking. But before he made that fumble, I was like, he kind of carried that ball kind of wild. I didn't say anything because I didn't want to jinx him, but I didn't even have to say it. It happened. But he was carrying that ball kind of wild. And it, as you see, it popped out. Fumble. But um, Kenyon Drake, what a stinker. 11 carries, 5 yards. I was like, why is do Greg Roman continually put this man out there? Let Gus cook. Let Justice Hill cook. But anyway, Mark Andrews out there. Yeah, okay. Now the receiving. Before I scroll down and see if I'm correct. Off my memory, I think I saw that, that beautiful catch Devin DuVernay caught. I think that was his only one. Um, Bateman, he had a drop. And Bateman had that catch close to the one. He had that good one, run one. So that's why I was like three, four. So I give him four. Um, Prochet was sighted. He was cited. Does that count? I know Mark Andrews has zero. Uh, but yeah, that's 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 how I think of. That's how I can think of. So let's see. Devin Duvernay. Okay. Yep. Two receptions. Three targets. Rashad Bateman. Four receptions. Five targets. Okay. Pat Ricard. Two receptions. Twenty yards. Yeah. Pat Ricard. If you seen the highlight video, yeah. We seen him doing his lot of critical one yarders, but um, then Isaiah likely. Then you see that that's nothing but zeros. 
That's why I give Greg Roman. That's Greg Roman report card from Kenyon Drake all the way down to Oliver. That's his report card for this game. All zeros. Young man, you are failing, even in PE. Okay. Um, but yeah, that that really just that really just shows the offense right there. That literally is the offense. Trash. Gus, you get an A plus. Lamar Jackson, from the what what they give you. I would give Lamar a B. I would give Lamar a B because there's no reason he should have 16 attempts. And Kenyon Drake, 11 carries, five yards. Oh, but that I don't even think that's that's one yard. That's like a what? Point two, point two yards, something like that. Point three, point four yards, a carry, trash. They that's just as hell fumble. Then PQ. I know Coach loving that. Sip to tally. If y'all don't follow him, follow him. Sip to tally. PQ he led the team in tackles. Got a sack. Got three tackles for loss. He was he was doing his thing. Doing his thing. He was cooking. He was cooking. Uh, Clark nine. Gino eight. I don't. I just don't like Gino. I'm be real. I don't like Gino, y'all. He got cooked on that one play. Marcus Peters play. They say it was on Marcus Peters. I'm going to say it's on both because, yeah, safety should always be back there with me. To me, if this team is continually get burnt over the top a lot like we've been used to for the last couple of years, a safety should, two safety should always be in the back. Um, but, yeah, so defense, like I said, they did they did good. They did all right. Um, hey, they 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 did all right. They did all right. Justin Tucker, goat. The punter stout. He had, he had a good punt. I give it to him. That's sixty nine. That was sixty nine yards. That was a good punt. That was a good punt. That was, that was a good punt. But um, yeah. So just quick thoughts. Um, coaching staff. Uh, I still believe it's trash. Um. Yeah, they, I feel like they're playing desperate. The play calling for his offense was very stale. Defense, I give defense a B. A B. I give him a B plus because they had the offense in so many special teams as well. And so many great positions to get a touchdown. And offense did not do anything. But Justin Tucker... Went back to the old school Justin Tucker and just continually giving us points because the offense can't generate anything. Like, Gus the Bus had two TDs, and on that last CD he got, that was just sloppy. I think I said that in the highlight. That was just sloppy. But overall, um, it was okay, game. You can see even in, like I'm looking at the chart right now, Baltimore – Offense scored three points in the fourth quarter. Three points in the fourth quarter. Cleveland scored seven. Yeah. So it's just a very, very sloppy game. Game shouldn't even been this close, really. It should have been a blowout. How many times the defense gave the uh, offense such great field uh, position. But, yeah, so... On to Thursday's game against Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay got spanked today. Uh, Tom Brady didn't even get a touchdown. They got three points, literally just three points. We should demolish them, but without a win loss win loss record, I wouldn't be surprised. I don't. I don't. I got to give it some thoughts before I before I give y'all my prediction. But anyway, y'all tell me what you all think about the game. Uh, for as my grade for the offense, they get a uh, C minus. Yeah, um, I'm going NBA 2K type type graded on them. You start with a C, they started with a C, and they ended with a C. So yeah, um, yeah, just C. And I, I I'm not even tripping on Jackson because no separation, bad play calling. He's trapped. He's trapped. But anyway. Thank you all for the for the likes and the views on my previous video. Everybody, stay safe. God bless. See you all Thursday.